It's fucking ridiculous how goddamn expensive this fucking renting environment's getting. It's getting to the point where it's just like, what do you want to do? Do you want to create a fucking homeless problem where people have to have, like, if they don't have, like, four fucking sorts of income, they can't afford to fucking live? You know what it caused it? Is this fucking retard up in Toronto thought it'd be a great idea to corporately buy up housing and then sell it back like rentals to people. This fucking asshole ought to not only be put in jail, but get his fucking ass kicked for the rest of his life, this piece of shit. Basically, they do a quick flip on housing, and they try to make it look like it's brand new, but all the work is really fucking cheap. You know, these amenities are brand new, but they're only brand new for that time, and they don't fucking have any hope of lasting. And they buy up whole neighborhoods and do this. You don't even have the opportunity to have, like, uh, you know, like a mom and pop, like, handyman come in and fix your shit, like a plumbing service or anything. It's all basically like an apartment complex neighborhood, essentially, where they have their own maintenance crews. Everything's internal. And you're paying, like, these ridiculous, ridiculous fucking fees. You're paying, like, $3,200 a month, which is fucking, like, asinine. This is why most people can't go for homes now because you have to pay so fucking much. Oh, I didn't do that. It didn't happen to me. I'm going to ignore the fact that I bought a place in the middle of fucking nowhere. Not in a fucking neighborhood like most people do. It's ridiculous. It's happening all over the country here. It's basically corporate buyouts are happening of whole fucking neighborhoods. And they're doing this and it's just ridiculous. People can't fucking afford to live in these places. 